And now to a Team 10 investigation. Social Service is now looking into how this two-year-old little boy was ended up wandering alone in an Encinitas Park. The Sheriff's Department says a mix-up in the preschool's head count is to blame. Team 10 investigator Adam Rakusin live in the newsroom. And Adam, what free tools do parents have to make sure that their kids are safe? Well, the state offers this website right here where you can really dig into your child care provider looking at child care centers to family child care home, even family child care home and adult residential facilities. They have also have, you can see if they've had any run-ins with the state. For here locally, you can look toward the YMCA. YMCA Child Care Referral Line. This is Andrea. How may I help you? You're looking at the front lines of child care referral in San Diego County. Perfect. And are you a parent? Teams with the YMCA educating parents on all the child care options available in the county. Start by telling you a little and bit. And steps to take. We're really sort of all things child care here. We're, we're attacking it from the family side in terms of those families who need to locate child care. And then from a provider side. Ariana Steck's the executive administrative specialist. She walked us through the YMCA's child care resource website, which gives families information to help them understand options for care. Also, the easy questions parents should ask any provider. How long have they been doing child care? care, what does a daily um, routine look like, what types of activities do they provide, what ages do they care for. Finding the right caregiver can be challenging, but Steck says parents should follow these five steps when visiting a child care program. Look, they want to listen, they want to count, they want to ask, and most importantly, they want to be informed. As a parent or guardian, you have the right to review a potential child care provider's public record. The state offers that online, giving you detailed information on any violations or citations they've received. But you can also pop into a local community care office and review their actual file. Being informed is the best way to protect yourself and your kids. It's really saying, can I come to your home and observe the interactions that are occurring? Can I have an interview with you one-on-one? -on -one? OK, and you can call the YMCA or go and visit them online. They can help you with the referral the same day or if you have time, really dig through the data and find the right child care provider. In the end, the choice is up to you and knowing what's best for your child. Reporting live in the newsroom, Adam Rakusin, Team 10. Keeping those kids safe. Thank you, Adam.